What's up everybody? Welcome back to another So Your Wife Wants You To. Today we are going to clean up the driveway a little bit. Wife has been asking, when are you going to get that oil leak changed? Well, we'll get to that later, but for right now, we're just going to clean the driveway. Better to put a band-aid on things sometimes than to fix the whole problem. It's easier anyway. So, there is a really cool video that I watched. Um, I will link the uh, video below. It's a different guy who tried uh, a couple of other chemicals to get uh, oil off of driveways and he had some pretty good success. So I'll link that below. Um, we are going to try bleach and we're going to try acetone. I like to do things on this channel just uh, based on stuff that you might have around the house. So bleach, you know, you might have that. Not really the safest chemical to use, but it might actually work. We're gonna try it out and see. So stay with me. We're gonna get this thing going. All right guys, so the supplies we're gonna use are acetone, like I said, bleach, and a wire brush. Definitely wanna use eye protection because even the littlest tiny droplet of bleach in your eye is gonna be a bad thing. I always use gloves. I always have gloves on. So let's get to it. So I'm going to do a little bit of bleach on this side, a little acetone on this side. And we're going to see if either of those will work. So I'll put the bottles next to the side we're doing here. So you know what? Actually, we're going to do, we're going to do bleach on this spot, acetone on this big spot. All right. So let's do it. Here's how I'm going to do it here. So this is like a, a low splash bleach. And it's kind of like a gel when it comes out. Watch it come out. It's real like almost gooey. Still really dangerous, but at least it won't splash as well. Put that cap back on. So I'm going to actually scrape it with my scraper here. I'm going to scrape it away from me only. I don't want it to splash up into me. You can see it's starting to kind of get muddy looking. That's a good thing. That means it's actually interacting with the oil. We're going to let that sit for a minute. Meanwhile, I'm going to do acetone on this thing. Definitely don't smoke when you're doing this. I I'm not a smoker, but... For those who are, that's a lot of acetone that could catch on fire pretty fast. Alright. I'm going to go turn the hose on and we're going to hose these off and see what happens. Alright, so in the two minutes that we were, I was gone, look what happened to this acetone one. I think it kind of mixed with the oil and started moving it. So what I did was get some Paper towels. This has only been a couple minutes. Paper towels. Let's open this acetone back up and we're going to get it wet again and try to soak it up. Alright, here we go. So I'm just going to pour some more on there and soak it up with the paper towels. Look how quickly it's evaporating. You can see it's pretty clear. So I don't really know where the uh, oil is going, but I don't think it's going in here because oil is really like really dark and this is really clear. But it's really kind of making the uh, oil disappear, which is actually pretty interesting. I'm trying to soak it up a little bit here. I mean, it's going away. All right, well, let's let's hose off the uh, bleached one and see what that does. Okay, the big spot is the bleach. We're going to hose it downhill and see what happens. See kind of a sheen on the water. I 
I think what I'm going to do is hose all of it down and then wait for it to dry and we'll get we'll start the video back up and see what it looks like. All right, we are back. I kind of artificially dried it with the leaf blower, but it's dry. So if you look right here, this right here is the bleach. So it didn't do a whole lot. This over here is the acetone. So it really moved it around, kind of made it wavy and cloudy. So I'm probably gonna go ahead and put some more acetone on, on the bleach side, and we'll see what it looks like here in a few minutes. And through the magic of video, it's gonna be a couple seconds. All right, I wanted to show you how I'm doing it here. So I'm literally just pouring acetone onto my driveway here. Wire brush. And it's working. I mean, it's working. I know matter is neither created nor destroyed, right? That's the uh, one of the laws, Newton's law or something. But it's definitely, um, it's definitely uh, keep it doing something to keep the uh, spots from sticking around. So that's good. So I'm gonna keep doing that. I think we kind of found a another alternative. I wouldn't say bleach, but definitely another alternative. The acetone is our winner today. So, but go ahead and check out. I forgot the guy's name but I'll link it below uh, his channel he uses a couple other products um, that he bought and does some testing out and it's, it's a pretty cool video so definitely take a look you probably want to subscribe to him I actually sub subscribed to him today but um, pretty cool uh, home home uh, fix it up type channel so that is all um, if you like this video if you got any value out of it give us a thumbs up and we will see you guys next time